Square up. Watch what you're doing. You watch what you're doing. The heck was that face for? Girl! Sebastian, I'm here. Ah. Let me just destroy some stuff real quick before I talk to you. Ah. Get. Whoa. Sebastian, I'm stuck. Ah, frick. Sebastian. Sebastian, come over here. I'm stuck. I can't, I can't get out. Oh, jeez. See, now that you have Avada Kedavra, things are easy. All you need in life is a killing curse. Uh, what the heck? Ooh, look at my wand. What the heck is happening? What the heck was that all about? Sir, are you friendly? Are you a good boy? Your eyes are red. What is happening? I'm floating! What's up, y'all? This is Trev Nano, and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. If you missed last episode, then you should probably go watch. It was basically, we finished up the storyline, and we had an epic battle with Ranrock. Now, what we're gonna probably gonna do is just do some random quests and side quests. Should still be interesting, so keep watching. If y'all enjoying the series, make sure to give it a like and comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe. Let's get into it. Oh, so we're not quite done, I guess. We got, I mean, we're done. But we're not quite done. Let's go speak with Sebastian. Get out of the way, girl. Get you. Look at me. Uh, I'm trying to jump on your head. Uh, get. 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 Get a jump on your head. Uh. Okay, never mind. Square up. Oops. Watch what you're doing. You watch what you're doing. The heck was that face for? Girl. Ha. Uh. Uh. Push ya. Oh. What? Why is there always some type of wind whenever I go in the undercroft? It just always blows my cape and wants to show my booty. Sebastian, I'm here. I'm glad you came. Ah. <laughs> Let me just destroy some stuff real quick <laughs> before I talk to you. Ah. Get. Whoa! Sebastian, I'm stuck! Ah, frick. Sebastian. Sebastian, come over here. I'm stuck. I can't... I can't get out. Oh, jeez. I'm really stuck. I, can, I cannot get out of this corner. One eternity later. Okay, Sebastian, I'm back and I got unstuck. Let me... I'm glad you came. Sebastian, I've received your owl. What's happened? Ominous spoke with Anne about what happened with my uncle Solomon. She believes I should pay for what I did, but she won't turn me in. She said the guilt I'll have to live with is punishment enough. I'm so sorry, but I'm glad you know that you can at least try to move on now. The thing is, I think I've lost my sister, my twin. Oh well, for I mean, we're pretty much done with the, she refuses the series to anyway. I can't blame her. I couldn't really blame any of you if you gave up on me entirely. You all believed in me, and I let you all down. Perhaps Anne will come Anne around. just needs some time. Surely one day she'll be able to forgive you. I hope you're right. I realize I can't undo what's been done, but I can try every day to make up for it. I owe you an ominous everything for standing by me. Well, it wasn't easy, but I believe in you, Sebastian. I've had a sense about you since that first day in Defense Against the Dark Arts. Seems so long ago. Thank you. I have no idea what's to come, but I'm grateful for your friendship. I'm glad you came to Hogwarts. Now we gotta talk, go talk to Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley, I'm here. Why, how pixelated your room is. Ah! Whoa, oh, stuff. I just stole your stuff. Ah, stuff. What's this say? I'll just read this letter in front of you. Dear Professor Weasley, thank you for your owl. I am overjoyed to hear that it is most recent crop of seventh years includes a number of students uh, who may be both interested and well suited for a career at the ministry. Of course, their owls will provide confirmation of the latter, but equally invaluable to our recruitment process is your opinion. You have a unique perspective given your experience with us, and for that, I am truly grateful. I look forward to further updates as the term progresses. Respectfully yours, Ferris Faven, 
Minister for Magic, London. All right, let me talk to Professor Weasley while I'm standing on her desk. Professor Weasley, you wanted to see me. I did. Oh, we now I'm on another desk anymore. Speak since I know you were quite close with Professor Fig. Hogwarts won't be the same without him. No, it won't. But I can assure you that he would want us to press on and that he would rest easy knowing that the future of the wizarding world is in hands like yours. Thank you, Professor. You've had quite a year, both inside and outside. I haven't done much inside Hogwarts. I've heard all sorts of rumors. You've ridden a raphorn, befriended a goblin, rescued hippogriffs, even somehow ingratiated yourself with the headless hunt. How did you? It's harder to keep secrets around here than one might what? suspect. That th isn't that just what Hogwarts is? Such a good friend in Miss Sweet. It sounds crazy, but that's just it's Hogwarts. It's nice to see her engaging more with her classmates. There have evidently been Snidget sightings in the area lately. If the centaurs are to be believed, two Hogwarts students are behind it. Uh, I'm certain. I don't know what. No need to discuss it further. What I would like to discuss is your wizard's field guide. May I see it? Of course. I haven't done much of it, to be honest. Ah, jeez. Are you grading my paper? What do you think, Professor? I think you've been busy this year. I see some progress here. But quite a bit yeah. of your field guide. I'm trying to save the completed. world. Who cares about my owls? You do have I'm trying some to save the world. To for your OWLs. I will confess, I had a sense about you from that first moment you came bursting in late to the sorting ceremony. I am pleased to see that my instincts were correct. To think you've only been with us a year and you'll already be taking your OWLs, well, it's nothing short of astonishing. Thank you, Professor for everything you are most welcome i look forward to seeing what you do during the rest of your time with us okay that other quest is locked apparently it's the house cup oh i have to reach level 34 first it's someone that needs help over here all right what do you need help with edgar adley sir um, um, should i talk to you sir there we go is there something i can help you with mr adley edgar adley uh, no no i don't think so Okay. Plus Milo and his mad schemes. Milo? He was my friend. Came to me a few days ago with a brilliant plan to make some quick galleons. All I had to do Aren't was follow ships? him to the Forbidden Forest. Had I known he wanted to procure venom from a living Acromantula. Oh, poor Milo. Mancha. He didn't deserve to I don't to know why I say like Mancula. That. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry to hear about your friend. Oh, thank you. I can't think of it. Milo's body is still in that cave with the absconder. The Absconder? Aye, Milo's name for the Acromantula. I did have a flair for the dramatic. <laughs> In fact, as he died, Milo begged me to take his heirloom pocket watch uh, so that his daughter would have something to remember him by. But I... Uh, I fled. So you're a wuss. Why chase after the Acromantula venom? Why would someone risk their life for spider venom? As a potion ingredient, Acromantula venom is incredibly valuable. In large part because it is... As Paul Milo has proven, impossible to get from a live Acromantula. I may be able to help. If I have time, I can try to collect the heirloom watch, Mr. Adley. You can't possibly go to the Acromantula's cave. You'd be killed. I already took down Rainrock. I guess word has not spread to this village yet. Okay, hold on. I gotta sell this stuff. Could you please remind me what you needed help No, with? no, no, no. I don't need to remind it. I don't want to... Aren't you a Acromantula's shop? I need to sell cave, stuff. Hoping to harvest its venom. I know what to do. It didn't I, go I, well. I, shush. I barely escaped. Milo no, Edgar, so you don't need to I'm repeat yourself. Can an You're a Milo's shop. I wish to sell goods. Okay, I can't sell you goods, apparently. Okay. <laughs> I I just made her drop all her whatever she was carrying, and then she's like, ah, oh, well, gotta go back and get some more. All right, I'm here now. Here at the cave. The cave must be somewhere in this maze. I wonder what else is in here. Probably spiders. So many spiders, so little time. Just walking through a cave full of spiders. This could be the Acromantula cave Mr. Adley mentioned. Now, where to do stuff? Ain't hey, nobody got time for another big spider. Where you at, girl? 
There you are. <sighs> Done. All right, easy peasy. Heirloom for Milo's daughter. Where are you at, heirloom? I found uh, leaping toadstool caps. Oh, it's over there. It's over here. I need to bring this heirloom back to Mr. Oh, I got it now. Easy peasy. Okay, now that you have Avada Kedavra, things are easy. All you need in life is a killing curse. Let's have it over there. What y'all doing over there? You're not doing anything unforgivable. Oh. They're taking out a troll by themselves. I'm just watching. You got this, guys. Oh, gosh. I'm not even involved. All right. I'll take all the glory. Uh, not today, dude. Nice try. Thanks for taking down those guys for me, though. Appreciate it. Uh, what the heck? Ooh, look at my wand. What the heck is happening? What the heck was that all about? I heard something. What did you do? What do you mean what I do? I, I do whatever I want, man. Alright, I'm back with your heirloom. I took the long way and fought some monsters. Because I was bored. I take it you so you are a shot. In the cave, then. Stop Mr. talking to me. I retrieved the heirloom pocket watch from Milo's body. <laughs> Merlin's beard! How did you? Because I'm a I, wizard. I don't want to know. I don't want to think about that acromantula ever again. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right, here you go. I'm glad Milo's daughter will have something to remember him by. I am too. As far-fetched as his schemes were, Milo was a good friend, and I shall miss him. Please, uh, accept this reward for your trouble. Uh, may I see your wares you so like I can sell you some stuff? Travel. All right, we're going to Why another town you? here. Looks like someone else needs help. What do you need help what with, ma'am? Alexander Ricketts? Is everything all right? If the Hamlet sent you here to talk to me about, about, I know what I have to do. It's not every day a girl has to put down her own troll. I should be allowed to work up to it. What do you mean your own troll? I thought that's why you were here. I'm sorry. You want me to take I out your pet? You spend enough time with trolls, you forget your manners. All I'm right. Alexandra. I didn't mean to be short with you. Let me add him. With Ranrock's lot seemingly everywhere, I thought the Hamlet could use a bit more security. Ran Ranrock's done. What? But my plan has gone awry. I apologized when he almost trampled half the Hamlet yesterday. He just needs more time. But everyone wants him gone. They think it's mad, my training a troll. Impossible, even. Uh, it's brave of you to try. It certainly takes a lot of courage to try. I'll give you that. Thank you. Thank you for saying that. I wish others felt the same. But I suppose I understand why everyone's been so concerned. What made me think I could train him? I should have learned from Barnabas the Barmy. Yes, but oh, Barnabas the Barmy. My problem. I'll be honest. I'm afraid I won't be able to take care of him. He's stronger than any troll I've ever encountered. I wish I knew someone else who could do it. What were you training the troll to do? What exactly were you training the troll to do? I was hoping to train him to serve as protection for us. Frankly, I struggled to teach him even a word or two. Couldn't give him even a semblance of self-control. Who's Barnabas the Barmy? Who's Barnabas the Barmy? Surely you've seen the tapestry of him at Hogwarts. It hangs no. in the seventh floor corridor. He allegedly I don't look tried at the, to train the trolls paintings for the ballet. Or anything. You can imagine how that turned out. Perhaps I can I'm do it. thrilled at the prospect, but I'll consider it. Oh, no. I didn't mean to suggest that you should do it. In fact, you should avoid the area just southwest of here. At least until I work up the courage to do what needs to be done. So that's where I should go. Okay. Will do. Troll on the loose near a hamlet. 
That could be devastating. Wait, it must the uh, dispatch. What the heck does that mean? The dispatch it. I take it you're Alexandra's friend. What I'm looking at it right now. Am I supposed to just take him down? Okay, hold on. Let me see if he's. Let's see if he's friendly. Sir, are you friendly? Are you a good boy? Your eyes are red. Are you good? Are you my friend? No. Okay, well. I feel awful for Alexandra, but Hamlet needed to be saved from that troll. It's kind of anticlimactic, less struggling when you have a killing curse. Although it only works on. It, it doesn't work on other bosses, though. It doesn't work on people bosses. I don't understand. Where you at, girl? There you are. Done. It's done, Alexandra. I took care of him. My troll? What? Oh, I don't know what to say. Thank you. I wish things could have turned out differently for him. You did what you could. There wasn't much you could have done. He was beyond training. He tried to kill me the entire time. Goodness. I'm glad you're well, I'd ask if he was friendly. He, he didn't People see me for the, the longest time for some reason. For whoever eventually defeated my, I mean, that troll. It was troll something or other. Huh? Whisperer? Whisperer? Yes, that was it. I suppose it's your title now. I need some time on my own. But truly, thank you for what you did. Oh, uh, by troll whisperer, troll you mean whisperer. troll killer. Seems fitting. Hello, might you have time to help with an urgent delivery? Um, let me read this first. Eddie, the Goblin's Rebellion's attacks on Phil Crafts are becoming more frequent. They seem to be searching for something. At least I failed to find another reason why they would target our little Hamlet. Regardless, trade is suffering and the people are struggling. Phil Crafts could certainly benefit from your creativity and optimism right now. You always seem to have the cleverest ideas. Any suggestions, my friend? I'm not sure how much longer Feldcroft can I'd survive. Yours, Bernard de Indiana. And my friend, Indiana. Time Stop talking. Delivery. I'm reading a letter. Jeez. So rude. Eddie. You sound as if you could use some help. How fortunate to see you. The, um, what was it? Troll, slayer, or vanquisher? Whisperer? No matter. You clearly know how to get things done. Eddie Thistlewood's the name. Listen. A friend of mine in Feldcroft needs help fighting Rangrock's loyalists. I sent two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages to help, but they've gone missing. Those cabbages can be fierce. Good idea. Those cabbages are nothing to be trifled with. My thoughts precisely. You see, I know plants, and I believe the goblins will be so irritated by the onslaught of ferocious vegetation, they'll simply leave Feldcroft alone. I wonder if you might track the two crates down and deliver their contents to my friend Bernard Indiai. Indiai can't leave my shop at present. Uh, why are the goblins attacking Feldcroft? Why would the goblins target Feldcroft? My friend Bernard says they've been seen in the area for a while. He seems to think they're looking for something, but lately they've become more aggressive. Couldn't you grow new cabbages? Could you not grow or buy more Chinese chomping cabbages? I suppose I could, but that would take time. Time we do not have, what with Ranrock's thugs posing new I took threats care of Ranrock already. Besides, it's the principle of the matter. I grew those cabbages, and they are extraordinary. Where do you think the crates are? Any idea where I might find the crates? Yes. From what I hear, one was spotted south of Feldcroft. The other, so I hear, is south of Brockborough, near the river. I'll see what Very I can well, do. Sir. I shall keep an eye out for two crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. Oh, thank you. I shall let Bernard know he might be receiving those cabbages after all. All right, bye. I should be going now. Thank you. I'm convinced that Feldcroft will be much safer Revelio. with Chinese chomping cabbages defending them. Sounds like Feldcroft's in trouble. Perhaps I should try to help. What is happening? I'm floating! I'm floating again. Uh. Okay, I just want up here so I get the stick. Okay, I'm literally stuck. Are these not stairs? Oh, what? You weren't there before. All right, we're here at the camp. Trying to get a good vantage point here.
Wow, I don't know how I avoided that, but you know. Let's go. All right. Rebellion. Oh, okay. That's one crate in hand. I only need one more. Oh, wait, he is. Eh. Arrest the momentum. Got him. Okay. Got him now. Let me do this Merlin's trial real quick and we'll be right back. Oh, dude. Merlin would be happy about this. All right. They must have the other crate of Chinese chomping cabbage. Uh, let's just jump off this cliff. Ah. Got him. Got him. Let them fight it out there. And I'll chill with the goat. All right, goat, what's up? Just chill with the goat. Okay, let me, uh... All right. We the whoa, there he goes. Okay. We defeated the goblins easy peasy. Although there's some over there actually. Hold on. Uh I, I could stealth, but I don't I don't feel like it. There he goes. Why do they always fly away? Ranrock suspects there is more of it in Felcraft. Do not return until you found it. Ranrock demands an update. Have you found it? Report back immediately. There's cabbages. That's all the crates of Chinese chomping cabbages. I'd better go and see Mr. Thistlewood's friend in Feldcroft. Alrighty. Alright, I'm here. Yeah. Do you have the special delivery from my dear friend, Eddie? I do. Hello, Mr. Undi. Eddie Thistlewood sent me. Yes, he told me to expect you. Do you have the Chinese chomping cabbages? Yes. I have them right here. Marvelous. This will go a long way towards protecting the hamlet from Ranrock's loyalists. The same foul curs who... I'm willing to guess, intercepted them in the first place, along with Rookwood's lot. Are they still thinking? I mean, I've, I've took down to you the entire trio. Thank you for your help. Uh, why are the goblins targeting Feldcraft? Do you have any idea why the goblins are attacking Feldcroft? No clue. I used to think it was because of its strategic location, but now it's as if they were looking for something. I will admit, however, that I don't know what they could Is that a pile of poo right there? How do you know Eddie? How do you and Eddie know each other? Is he just... We met at Hogwarts. It, been friends is there just a pile of poo on sense. his table? I wasn't surprised to get his owl about his uh, Chinese there's flies around. scheme. He was always one to go out of his way to help another. Uh, glad to help. You're welcome. Happy to be of assistance. At last, some reinforcements. Hopefully this is enough to thwart the goblins. All right, now we're at the well. Did, did Jimmy fall in the well again? Ow! Can you help me? Is someone down there? Wait, there's water in it. Wait, what? How can I hear a voice when there's water in there? There's no one here but me. What? Some thoughtless wretch casually tossed a bit of parchment into me. If you could please. Take it. <laughs> what? Ah, treasure map. Seems to be some sort of map. <sighs> thank you. Oh, thank you. What a relief. I hope the map serves you well. Oh, at least better than any tea. Okay. Now I have to look at the map. Ah, frick. That's not a very interesting quest. You know what? That's probably a good stopping point. We've done a bunch of the side quests that we do stuff. Looks like other quests are just doing treasure hunting. Uh, if y'all want to see that, make sure to let me know down in the comments. But if y'all enjoyed the series, make sure to give this video a like. And don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see y'all next time.